Hi, my name is Tengku Jan Lee. So in the last episode, we spoke about tire pressures. So this time, we'll be talking about tires. Tires are the only part of the car which are in contact with the road. Safety in acceleration, braking, steering and cornering all depend on a relatively small area of road contact. So look after your tires and your tires will look after you. Hydroplaning occurs when the tyres cannot process enough water through its straight design to maintain effective contact with the road. The water pressure causes your car to float and slide on a thin layer of water between your tyres and the road, effectively causing you to lose control. So that's why it's very important to make sure that you have enough tread on your tyres, which will be covered in the next topic called tread wear. If you have a proper measuring tool called the tread wear gauge, the minimum tread depth for international standards is 1.6 mm. To determine if your tyres have sufficient tread depth, look for the triangular marking called the tread wear indicator located at the shoulder of the tyre. If the tread is worn down to the tread wear indicator, then it is time to replace your tyre. But for safety purposes, please replace your tyres when it reaches 2 mm. One of the simple ways of checking if the tyre tread depth is enough is to insert a 20 cent coin into the groove. If the word cent is clearly visible, then the tread depth is insufficient and the tyre should be replaced. Driving in the rain with worn tyre is very dangerous. Rainwater forms a film between the tyre and the surface of the road, lifting the tyre off the road and rendering the steering wheel and brakes ineffective. New tyres with deeper tread are more capable of resisting hydroplaning, therefore helping the driver maintain control in wet conditions. Here is a comparison of stopping distance on wet surface between new and worn tyres. At the speed of 90 km per hour and from the same braking point, there is a difference of approximately one car length. So now that we've covered the basics of tyre safety, so let me share you a few tips on tyre maintenance. Always keep your tyres at the recommended level. Maintain good tyre tread, so don't put off replacing worn tyres. And always slow down when the roads are wet.